The Aeronautical Developmental Agency has invited bids from Indian vendors on 19 May for the design and fabrication of 1 is to 4.7 scale of the Tejas Mark II air intake model that will be used for wind tunnel testing and will help to make more design refinements in the air intake of the aircraft. The Aeronautical Developmental Agency has also invited bids for manufacture and supplying of the Jimbal assembly with Venturi and combined drain pot bellow. The Jimbal assembly with Venturi is used to provide flexibility for bleed air ducts to compensate for thermal expansion or contraction, while the combined drain pot bellow forms a flexible interface between engine and airframe drain pipes, which drains the engine lube oil, hydraulic fluid and fuel overboard the airframe. At a time when India has agreed to send its Tejas Mark I fighter jets to participate in the Bangladesh Air Show 2022, and is all set to pitch the indigenous fighter jet for its requirement, the US has offered to sell around 18 to 36 F-16 Block 72 fighter jets to Bangladesh. The Bangladesh Air Chief was also given a tour of an F-16 manufacturing plant recently. In order to qualify for F-16 purchase, Bangladesh has also lifted ban on travel to Israel, and has also removed invalidity clause mentioned in its passports for Israel visit. Indian destroyers usually get a refit after every 8 to 10 years, during which the Navy can upgrade the ship and integrate new sensors and missiles if available. INS Kolkata Stealth Guided Missile Destroyer was commissioned in 2014, and it will enter refit after the first P-15B destroyer INS Visakhapatnam is delivered to Indian Navy between July to September 2021. Instead of increasing the number of P-15B destroyers from existing four units, the Indian Navy aims to build first few P-18 next-generation destroyers immediately without the sea-based elements of ballistic missile defense shield, as the Navy is taking the threat from China's 12,000-ton Type 55 destroyer very seriously, and plans to counter this mega-destroyer with the 13,000-ton next-generation destroyers that will be built by Mazagin Dock Limited. The Indian Navy will soon approach the Union Ministry of Defence for acceptance of necessity for building six nuclear-powered attack submarines under the Make in India model, and the national security planners have already started looking at France, UK, US and Russia as possible partners for joint development and production. The French Naval Group is one of the key contenders for the SSN project with full transfer of technology of Barracuda-class submarine, while the British firm BAE Systems can offer a customized Astute-class submarines in the program. The 5,300-ton Barracuda is smaller than the 7,400-ton Astute-class submarine, but the Barracuda marches Navy's requirement of a 6,000-ton SSN. And one interesting feature is that the Barracuda requires a smaller crew of 65 due to increased automation, as compared to 98 crew for the Astute class. The Barracuda also has room for 15 Special Forces operatives, and their bunks can be utilized for any extra crew if required by the Navy. Both the Barracuda and Astute class have unlimited range, but the nuclear fuel has to be refueled in every 10 years in the Barracuda class while the astute submarine features advanced nuclear technology, and will never require to be refueled for the entire service life of the submarine. France has been one of India's most reliable allies since the sanctions in 1998, and is also building six Scorpion submarines at Mazagin Docks Limited. France also does not have any regulatory regime like the US and UK, that could halt the SSN program by enforcing international traffic in arms regulations. A spokesperson from Hanwar Defence has said that the company has offered its 105mm K21 light tank solution for the Indian Army's requirement of 350 units, and Hanwar Defence will also be pleased to offer the K21 light tank as a Make in India product with indigenous production at the existing facilities of Larsen and Tubro, that is currently idle after completing the delivery of 100 K9 Vajra howitzers to the Indian Army. Oh, my God.
Tangent.